if you look at something like wind and uh, solar energy, how much do they produce um, per per atom of construction, I guess? So what I'm trying to get at is mm. if you look at uh, a solar farm, wow, that's fantastic. It's like super efficient apart from the nighttime, so not super efficient. But that you have to mine so much zinc to mm. get that, which the zinc is coating. I think that's one of the main things. Like they coat zinc on the the, on the reflective layers, which shoot it into the the place where it heats up and whatnot. And it's like, okay, but how much energy do you have to expend to to get that zinc out of the ground, mm. transport it where it needs to go? I heard some stuff when I was looking around that that's pretty high, and I heard some people claiming that's higher than what the expected value of energy from the lifetime of that particular machine. Gotcha. So even though you could be saying, wow, this is super energy efficient, like it's it's green and whatnot, it's actually not producing more energy than it costs Took to like to get manufacture. everything out of the ground. And it's sort of like, wow, we're we're real eco friendly, we're doing something good for the environment, but it's just because we've already we've, spent we've, that energy well, to Well yeah, it's, it it's almost like you've just pushed it so far down the chain you can't see it. Mm. It's like you know sort of wow apple is this really great product but then all the way down the line maybe there's some child labor involved or something like that mm. so it's sort of that that sort of conundrum so i'm wondering if in the future people will be able to really dive into the energy issues and really account for things okay mm. this you know kilojoule of of energy that was produced via the thermal coal how many like atoms were used to expend like to to create that how much energy and atoms were used for the creation of that one that that energy yeah no i know what you mean. No, i do know what you mean i think it's, it, it's like a way of like a real good way of accounting from top to bottom like start to finish where did this energy come from and how was it used yeah. and i feel like you'd need to get down to the like the atom level sort of like this is where those atoms are gotcha. being used from you're using uh those zinc atoms, which are not as replenishable as carbon. No, no, no. You mm. can't do that. that like, yeah, that, that should cost okay, more, maybe. Yeah, 